Okay, so <clears throat> here we go. Uh, this is going to be the first intro for my new series I'm going to do here called TCG to VGC. So what I'm going to do, I've got these battle style uh, card packs. Forgive my terrible, terrible webcam here. Uh, I don't know how I'm going to do this. But uh, I've got these battle style card packs, right? And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to open one. And I'm only allowed to use Pokemon that I pull from the pack. Um, as this is the first experimental uh, episode, I'm firstly going to allow myself to evolve everything. <laughs> so if I get, you know, a uh, if I get a Grookey, that means I'm I can use Rillaboom. Uh, I'm going to make the decision that if I am to draw any items, um, I'm required to equip that item on at least one of my Pokemon, I guess one of my Pokemon, because there's item clause in VGC. Um, I hope that this is going to be a fun series. Uh, I know that the trading cards have been kind of coming back a little bit lately. So uh, without further ado, we're going to open this week's pack, or this episode's. I don't know how often I'll be uploading these. Um, yeah, so I'll try to open this gingerly here. I don't know if there's a specific way... You're supposed to do this. Um, it's been a while since I opened one of these. There we go. Okay. I also don't... I, I didn't look it up ahead of time, so unfortunate. We may see our rare in the middle of the pack, but that's okay. Okay, so the first card we're going to see is... Let's see if I can get this webcam to have you see it with me. Uh, there you go. All right, so we're going to get an Esper, so Meowstic. Uh, that could be kind of good. The focus on this camera. Man, this thing is bad. Um, Meowstic is good. It's going to have Fake Out. It's going to have, uh, you know, it's a good support mon, so not, not bad for our first pull. Not bad for our first... Ooh, Conkelder. Oh, darn it. Sorry. Uh, yeah, Conkelder was really good at the beginning of VGC and Sword and Shield, so... Uh, We'll see. Uh, we'll see how Conkelder can do. Maybe, maybe we got a trick room, trick room team coming here. Uh, ooh, a Galarian Slowpoke. We have a very slow team here, um, but that's fun. That's fun. So, uh, Galarian Slowbro or Slow King. We'll see how I decide to build the team. Uh, Corefish. I don't know if that's even in Sword and Shield, um, but it's an interesting choice. A, a big time trick room team, man. We got. Oh, it definitely is. It definitely is in. Uh, in Sword and Shield. So, anyway, uh, yeah, so that that could be fun. We got a Trick Room team, heavy Trick Room going on right now. Uh, Salandit, okay, okay, so now we get a little speed, so we don't have to run pure Trick Room. <laughs> um, ooh, is this the rare? This is the rare. Age of Slash, this Trick Room team is going to be lit, man. Oh, man. All right, we get a Reverse Hollow Age of Slash. Um, nice, that'll be fun. That will be fun. So this team is not looking bad. Um, it's not looking that bad, actually. Oh, Empoleon! A V Empoleon. Man, ah. Oh. Empoleon is one of my all-time favorite Pokemon. It's very unfortunate that it's not in Sword and Shield. Um, so I cannot use this Pokemon uh, in VGC. That is very unfortunate. But it's cool that I got a... Uh, Rapid Strike Wimpoleon. That's uh, that's fun. The collecting of this is kind of fun. So, um, not that I have a collection anymore, but um, it's 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 cool. It's neat. Uh, we have a Water Energy there, so I don't think that's gonna do anything for me for for this. If uh, you know, leave a comment below if you have any ideas. You know about so if I have an energy, is that maybe you know if this if these packs end up being really difficult or um, you know I'm not looking to go <laughs> on a huge winning streak with these teams. It's just for fun. Um, but maybe, you know, maybe I can use this as a wild card, right? So, uh, oh, I know. Oh no, here's a good idea. I'm just kind of thinking on the fly. Uh, so in July, we still have the regular kind of format, um, with no restricteds allowed. Maybe the energy tells me what restricted I can use, uh, moving forward in uh, future, future seasons, like in August when they, when they do that. Uh, I don't know. Anyway, just leave a comment if you have an idea. Um, about what I can do for that, or just any other fun quirks to throw in here. Uh, Dublade, I already have Aegislash, so that's kind of a waste. Uh, Cacturn, um, Cacturn, is that in Sword and Shield? 
Um, either way, it's another Trick Room Mon. We are very Trick Room heavy. Uh, Rapid Strike Style Mustard. Um, <laughs> you know, supporter cards, right? Maybe I'm allowed to use a Pokemon from his his uh, in-game team or something. Uh, I'm not going to do that for I'm not going to do that for this particular pack poll, but um, but yeah, leave comment with with your ideas. And then I get the code. Uh, I'm going to burn that code before <laughs> before because uh, I do sometimes play on the online uh, on the online one because that's kind of fun sometimes. Uh, but yeah, so it's looking like we're going to run a pretty Trick Room t heavy team. We've got a lot of slow Pokemon, and uh, I will get back to you when I have the team built. So uh, see you in a minute. Okay, here we go. Uh, you, as you may be able to tell already, I've uh, fixed my audio issues finally um, by using a head. Well, I was using headset before, but I messed up like setting it up and stuff. Anyway, um, so here we are, the first episode of TCG to VGC. Uh, I've got the first team here. Um, can I like look at it? Uh, yeah, I'll show it to you later. Um, obviously. I'll have in this video probably the first, um, what do I have you in for? Probably not many, right? I don't even have the gym battle. Oh no! <laughs> okay. Um, so here we go. It's a hard trick room team. Um, just to give a quick summary. Oh, they're using the rain, <laughs> the rain rental. Okay, so we've got my shiny Aegislash here who is specially offensive but does have the priority shadow sneak. Uh, we have a Guts Flame Orb, Conk Elder. We have uh, Slowbro here who's supposed to set Trick Room. He's very bulky. He's got the Mental Herb um, for taunts. Um, the Salazzle because <laughs> I didn't have any other choices. And it's a good idea to have something fast in case, you know, you just don't think you can set up Trick Room or whatever. And I don't know. Um, and then we have Meowstic here. So basically the lead idea is supposed to... Oh, and Cronaut. Choice Banded Cronaut. Um, so Cronaut is supposed to be... He's Adaptability... Liquidation, we've got the Aqua Jet, we've got a knockoff, we've got a switcheroo if we really feel like it. So basically the idea is to lead with Meowstic and Slowbro, get up Trick Room. Uh, Meowstic we kind of want to probably set a screen and hopefully go down. Um, we'll see how that goes. <laughs> Again, I'm not expecting to win a lot. Uh, we are starting on a fresh account, it might help our, <laughs> our chances, but... Uh, okay, so I don't think this team has a good Ghost Resist. So I'm going to go with Ag Aegislash. And actually, Conkelder looks really nice too. So we'll do that. Um, all right, let's see how this goes. The first, finally I'm getting around to doing, I've been meaning to do this TCG to VGC stuff for a while. Um, oh, my number's zero because I haven't, I haven't reached that part of the game yet. That's funny. Um... All right, so we're going to see Pelipper Bear Skewda. Yep, that's kind of expected. So this is exactly what I'm talking about. I could fake out like the Bear Skewda, but he can also Dynamax. Um, so fake out's not that good in this meta until next season. So I'm going to click because we're max Fizz Def. Is that correct on Slowbro? Check summary. We should be max Fizz Def. Yes. Okay. And I can go ahead... Set up a light screen to help survive some some of these hits, um, and then use Trick Room. And hopefully, hopefully they eliminate um, the Esper, or no, it's not Esper. It's Meowstic, right? Meowstic. Oh, I'm so I'm so excited that I'm finally doing this. I've been meaning to do this for so long. Like I've had this literally thought out and planned for like since I even started with YouTube. Ooh, that's right. We're not though. Uh, that's dangerous because we're not. Uh, water type we don't resist that so we get the trick room off meowstic's gonna take a good chunk but slowbro's gonna get the trick room off okay now do we just hard swap or do we go for an expanding force we don't have the terrain um part of me wants to just hard swap into aegislash and if we don't get in safely um, then we can, yeah, actually Aegislash and then Bulldoze to get my, yeah, I think that's the play. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we'll get our weakness policy. Um, ooh, okay. So the Bulldoze will actually hit the Ferrothorn, which is not good, but we do have Yawn. 
Uh, he's probably slower, though, because when we built this team, I was sort of lazy about it. I mean, this is just supposed to be a fun series, right? Oh, this could not have gone better. This could not have gone better. We get in Aegis Lash for free with weakness policy. Okay, so I feel bad he's using the he's using the rental team like the AI's rental team and here I am. But hey, I'm using these Pokemon were pulled out of a TG a TCG pack. Right? So we're gonna go ahead Dynamax. I think Max Phantasm is it yeah, effective on Ferrothorn. We will yawn the Skuda. Um I could also yawn the Ferrothorn, who probably can't hurt Aegislash. Let's do that instead. Let's max uh, Phantasm Barrascuta and yawn on Ferrothorn. Because then Ferrothorn gets uh, to take a nappy nap. It was probably not getting one shot anyway, but we know we'll one shot the Barrascuta. And actually, now that I'm maxing, I mean, what are you going to do? Leech Seed me? This Aegislash is about to... Aw, oh, look at him, that giant, shiny Aegislash. Look at him. Her. Excuse me, it's 2021. The Iron Head comes out, you can't flinch me. Oh, boy. Uh, so we're going to get the Yawn off on the Ferrothorn, and goodbye, Barrascuta. Yeah, maybe I should have played on my main account for this instead of starting at rank 1. Well, the other thing about that, though, is that I don't always hit master rank, and I'm always trying to make that grind throughout the month, um, and I don't expect these teams to always be great. <laughs> um, I mean, this team, I just kind of got a little bit lucky, you know? Uh, let's... he... he's probably going to switch the Pharaoh. I'm just going to go after the Ludi. Um, let's just heal Pulse Age Slash, too. Why not, right? I mean... Slowbro's not really doing much else, so. I guess I could have yawned the Ferrothorn slot uh, in case he switched that slot. But here's the thing, is that Kelder beats the Ferrothorn in the back easily, easily, so. I'm gonna try to squeeze in three battles for this. We'll see how long they take, but um, let's see, you're probably maxing the Ludicolo. Um, which, it could hurt. If I I didn't go back to my uh, King's Shield form, so if this doesn't Oko, this could actually be a little bit of trouble. I mean, no, I still have how many turns of Trick Room? I've only max attacked once, right? I switched, though. So the Iron Head's coming out on Slowbro. That shouldn't knock me out. It comes closer than you think, though. We do get to recover to full. That may matter for this. I don't know. Oh, it's not full because he's Dynamax, right? So let's see if plus two knocks him out. It does not. It lowers his defense, though. And Ferrothorn stays in and stays asleep. I did not count my Trick Room turns. Oh, it's defense, though. Right, right, right. Defense is a problem. That shouldn't do too much. It's probably an Ice Beam, too, so we have the Light Screen still. Um, that was a crit. That was a crit? Wow. Um, okay. But now the thing is, no, I'm on, I'm slow on everything, so. Slowbro's gonna live. Which almost we don't want him to, because we, actually, what I think I'm gonna do, here's the real play. How is my, I'm quiet, right? How is my attack stat? Because we lowered his defense. Uh, oh my god. What? Did I not change? Oh my god. I didn't change his, his nature. <laughs> oh, oh my god. Okay, well, I'll change it for the next episode. I'll, I'll be a dunce for this episode. Um, no, it probably won't take very long. to. Oh no, I can't because it's... I. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to switch the slow bro out. 
get regenerated. Oh, we don't have regenerator either. <laughs> oh, boy. So, okay, maybe now you understand why I am not uh, doing this on my main account. <laughs> so, the Aegis Lash was supposed to be quiet. And he's adamant. I wonder who else I messed up. This should do way more. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because I completely messed that up. And Slowbro is not, uh, I think he's quick draw, not, not, uh, not regenerator. Um, so I'm going to come out of my max. I think that also ends Trick Room, yeah, and the light screen. But that's okay, because we have Esper back out, and we can now, uh, oh yeah, it's Pelipper. I forgot it was Pelipper. Uh, who's a bigger threat? Here, Pelipper's a bigger threat because we have Kunkeldon in the back. So I will fake out the Pelipper. Um, I'm not really worried about an Iron Head from the Ferrothorn. So we will Shadow Ball the Pelipper, which unfortunately is going to do more damage and fake out Pelipper. So yeah, I am not going to go. So basically, I built this team on my main save. I put it on a rental team, and then I rented the team on my side save. Um, and I'm realizing now that, the, yeah, so I can't change this very quickly. Um, so what I'll have to do is I'll play this episode out. We'll see how long it takes to do two battles, um, how long it takes to do three battles. And after that, I will come back. I will fix the nature. I am actually very curious what else I messed up. Um, <laughs> okay, they canceled. That's fair. Um, so we'll at least do one more. I mean, it's still good fun, right? This is this is supposed to be... Hey, the Adamant kind of helped us there, right? We actually have better attacks or priority move. <laughs> oh, boy. You can probably... It's probably picking up. That's funny. Sometimes it picks her up talking and... Sometimes it doesn't. My daughter or my wife in the background. I think it's because I had to push up the gain to make my voice a little louder and clearer. But all right, um, let's see. I, okay, we're versus another trick room team. And actually, let me check the natures now. Now that I get a chance, who else did I mess up? Because you're adamant. You're supposed to be quiet. You are adamant. That's fine. You are relaxed. That's correct. You are timid. That's correct. You are modest. I should have been timid, actually. Um, but it doesn't matter. For the most part, it doesn't matter because of Prankster. It matters if we fight, like, a Tornadus or something. But, um... And you are... <laughs> uh, you should definitely be brave, not... What would that even... Naughty? No, Naughty is minus Spadef. Uh... Well, I'm just trying to do it off the top of my head. Anyway, so, are we going to run the Trick Room or are we going to let him do Trick Room? I'm actually going to lead Crawdont... And do you think Salazzle can Oko? Who's faster, Aegislash or Crowdon? Uh, 80 speed, 60. Oh, perfect. Okay, so I'm going to lead Aegislash Crowdon because I'm expecting Togekiss to uh, follow me while he sets his Trick Room. Um, and then in the back, Conkelder and Meowstic for the screens is kind of nice because he's going to have screens too, probably. Oh my god. <laughs> I messed this up so bad. Okay, so what it's minus defense plus attack is uh come on now. Um mild is the special attack version of that. Hey, no, hasty is the speed version of that. Um Oh, interesting. Interesting that the uh he comes out. Okay, so he can fake out my Crawdon. So I'm going to expect a fake out. And I'm going to go ahead and swap Crawdon out. Keep Crawdon safe. I'm going to go into Meowstic. Um, or actually, you know who a good one would be? Would be to switch into Conkelder. Because um, if he doesn't set Trick Room, I should be faster than... Because, well, I don't, it depends on how... <laughs> if he did the same as me, right? Uh, I guess Flash Cannon is safer. Not maxing yet. Let's just Flash Cannon and not max yet. I don't know what he's going to do with Togekiss. So Cronaut's going to come out. 
we might lose this because Togekiss is kind of a problem. Um, oh, okay. Then what are you gonna... Are you just gonna Flare Blitz into Aegislash? Nope, he fakes out. Okay. So, okay. So this is an interesting turn. Uh, well played, I suppose, because now we're... Uh, yeah, we're going through this. So I think I'm gonna protect... Or maybe do I double and King? I 100% King shielding the Age Slash. Um, I kind of want to max this now, actually, because if I Dynamax, I should live a hit. I don't know if Togekiss does. Yeah, let's do it. This is supposed to be fun, right? I'm not going to worry too much. I already am having a ton of fun, though, just messing around with this ridiculous team. It's not that ridiculous, though. So I haven't really experimented with it much yet, so I wonder if by... Like, if, if, if you can actually make a good team out of every pack like this. Is that actually possible? So I'm not actually min speed, and he might be because of Trick Room shenanigans. We'll see what happens. If he doesn't max for... Oh, okay, good. He didn't max... So no matter what Togekiss does, we for sure live it, and we're gonna take down. We're gonna take it down, I think. Um, Dazzling Gleam comes out. We should easily live that. Oh, whoa! Okay, that's a lot of damage, man. He's gonna parting shot the. Okay, nice play, nice play. He read the uh, move there, but. We are going to get rid of the Togekiss, which was a huge problem for Conkeldur here. So what? Aegislash is now minus one. And I don't really care if you trick room, because we're both... Um, well, we are what we are. <laughs> uh, so that's going to do it. That's going to KO easily. Um... Hmm. I kind of want to switch Aegislash out, but I think it's safer to keep Crawdon in the back. As well as screens. We also have to be aware of ally switch shenanigans. Uh, let's see. Incineroar comes back out. Okay. So you're minusing the attack here. You are one million percent... Watch this play. Are you ready for this? Are you ready for this play? Watch this play. How much is this? 90? Watch this play. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and this time... I don't care. I'm going to Shadow Ball that side. Watch this play. Do it. I'm going to look like such an idiot if he doesn't do it. Do it. Realistically, I should have doubled into one side in case he didn't ally switch, but no, no, no. We're not being realistic here. Come on, do it. Aw, oh, man. Was that me or is that him? Looks like it was they disconnected. Oh, that's such a bummer, too. <laughs> oh, that's such a bummer. I wanted to see that. Did he have it? Did he have it? He didn't even have it. <laughs> so that was actually a terrible play. Uh, we'll definitely grab one more because that second one was kind of quick. Oh, that's funny. All right, rank two. I'll record too. I'll keep track of which teams go with what record. Um, getting BP even though I haven't done the first gym yet. That's funny. Uh, we'll change it up this time. Or no, we'll keep it. We'll keep it consistent through an episode. How about that? Yeah. So, okay. So now we also are much more aware of our natures going into this. Um, all right. This team is not really prepared for Trick Room. The Toxapex is annoying. Who can deal with Toxapex? Nobody can deal with Toxapex. Uh, <laughs> nobody on my team can deal with Toxapex. That is not great. We'll do, this, we'll do the Trick Room strat and then... Oh, boy. Maybe Crawdon puts in work here. 
Kinkelder I like because it deals with the Lapras. Um... I'm thinking... So it's got to be Aegislash or Crawdon. How much time for you? I don't... Uh, I like Crawdon, I guess, for the priority? No. I still like Crawdon, I think. Better than Aegislash. Uh, yeah, I'm running out of time. Let's just do it. I don't care. Crawdon hasn't gotten to do anything yet. I've, Aegislash has been at the forefront of each game, so let's let's mix it up a little bit. I am shocked that my family's being this quiet for this long. <laughs> Don't want to disturb the peace. My wife is waving me down like, no, no! <laughs> okay, so we'll just do the thing here. Uh, you probably... We're going to light screen in Trick Room. That's, that's as easy as it gets, right? Um, because they're both special attackers. Um... And listen, my voice cracked there. Holy crap! Um, yeah, so I'm still hoping that they take down Esper again. If they take down, I keep calling it Esper. If they take down Meowstic turn one, that'd be great. But I'm expecting like Overdrive maybe from Toxtricity. Uh, I'm not actually a Water type on Slowbro, so through Light Screen we should be fine. And then the Lapras maybe goes for a the ice move to get their screens onto Meowstic, maybe? Um, not sure. He's definitely going to do the ice move onto one of them. And actually, because he's going to have screens, I'm going to look at the rest of his team. Well, let's see what happens here. So we're going to get our light screen. And then what's going to happen? You see the overdrive, that's what we thought. How much is that gonna do to Slowbro in particular? Nothing. Okay. Yep, this is what we thought. Go into Meowstic, please. Nope. They're smart. They knew that I was gonna trick room. So we're good. We're gonna get our trick room off. Um, which means I can also yawn the Lapras, which is amazing. Because I did not bring the Aegis Slash, so we're not gonna bring it in on a Bolt. Or oh, wait a minute. Maybe we reflect into a Bulldo? No, because I don't want to make their Pokemon slower than mine. That would be really dumb. The only reason to do that would be that Toxtricity takes so much from it. But uh, I can actually Expanding Force, because I don't want the Reflect right now, really. Um, I may come to regret that. Uh, um, I may come to regret reflecting. I mean, attack, not having reflect. Alright, fine, we'll do it. We'll reflect, and we will yawn the Lapras. So I should... Oh yeah, Meowstic Prankster goes first. This is why it didn't matter that I was modest, not timid. But it only matters if we're fighting Thunderous. So we get the yawn off. Now please KO the Slowbro. Or just KO somebody. That's really all I want. I want to see somebody go down. <laughs> Meowstic... Oh, an Overdrive might pick up both? I don't know. Um, Snarl comes out. Please get the Meowstic. Yes! Okay. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Because we do not care about that. We have our screens, and now we have two turns of max still. Um, I may go and protect Conkelder, actually. Get the burn, and then max after that. Uh, I still think it's the safest play. Because we can come in with Banded Aqua Jets at the end if we run out of Trick Room. So we're going to go Conkelder. Um, although we have to be careful of the Dragapult. How many turns of Trick Room? We have three left, so I almost don't want to waste it, actually. Uh, now nah, let's do the smart thing and protect, and because he's going to go to sleep at the end of the turn and yawn Toxtricity this time. So, with both screens up, we're also sort of stalling out his turn, but we don't want to stall... Oh, nice! We actually, that was a really good play, then. Um, 
Because now... Why would he max guard? He's going to fall asleep. I don't even have to max yet, actually. I 100% don't have to max yet. As I can just do a life orb massive drain punch on... Uh, on the uh, sleeping Lapras. Actually, I have a free turn. Why would I even do that? I should drain punch on the... Make sure to get rid of the other thing. I Part of me wants to... Not... Click... Oh, here's what we can do. We can Aqua Jet... Is how many turns of Trick Room we have? We have two turns of Trick Room. So what we can do is actually... Ooh, Rock Slide is tempting. We will Drain Punch the Toxtricity, but we're going to Aqua Jet with Krata first. So if he's like Sash or some shenanigans... Uh, this should really hurt. A Choice Banded in the rain. If he's focused, don't be focused, Sash. Nice! I don't know if that crit mattered. I doubt it. Uh, let me pull up a calc over here just to see. And then the Drain Punch right goes into Lapras because the other guy went down. Oh my god, that didn't kill it? Lapras is so bulky, man. I definitely played that right by not maxing. Oh, my audio mixer bugged out again. Uh, hopefully, last time you could hear me that this happened, so it's not a big deal. But All right, Crawdaunt. I am Choice Banded. Um, we know we're max attack versus a... Oh, no, not Toxapex. Um... That's actually really annoying. I think I have to max the... Now I th I'm pretty sure I Drain Punch Lapras and I max this guy for don't max Darkness on the Toxapex. I think that's my only choice, because Toxapex is going to be really annoying now. Anyway, back to the Calc. It was versus a... Uh... What the heck was it? Um... Why am I so bad at remembering this stuff? It's the... I can picture him. Toxtricity. Toxtricity. Let's put them both at level 50. Even outside of rain... Oh, no, not outside of rain. It doesn't KO. In rain, it's a roll. There's a 75% chance to OK. Oh, that's with no investment. Right. So with no investment, that had a... That Aqua Jet had a 75% chance to... Yeah. It may have mattered. So Lapras goes down... I wonder, we're probably not slower than... Yeah, we get a... That's fine. I don't really... He's going to have one Pokemon left. There's no Trick Room, but he's got two huge threats here. And he doesn't have a max. Oh, th of course, we're not going to one-shot it. That was stupid. Um, so, but here's the thing. Is, now that Trick Room is reversed... Uh, we know that whatever comes in... So, Tox... Toxpex is the slowest thing. So I have that going for me. Cinderace comes out. Um, I might just... I think it's Mock Punch. I don't know if that a Mock Punch will KO. Um, hmm, or do we Rock Slide? Because what we're afraid of now is... If he can KO Crawdont... Let's go ahead and calc that, actually. I don't want to calc. Why am I calcing for this? This is ridiculous. It's only because it's already open. High jump kick will KO uh, if he's just Jolly Libero. Um, or it can. It can KO the the other guy. So actually what I think I'll do is I'll drain punch the Cinderace and can I max guard because I have switcheroo? Yes, that's what we'll do. I mean, that's the play, even if it doesn't KO. Baneful Bond... Oh, that was perfect. That turn was perfect. Oh, or maybe not. <laughs> maybe not. Uh, oh, boy. That's a trouble. That's a problem. Um, or is it a problem, actually? Because now we assume that the bounce is going into Conkelder. Right, and Bounce is not going to kill Crawdot, for sure. So, we actually protect Conkelder and Max Darkness the Toxapex, which we already saw it does half. Um, 
And we have a choice band at Aqua Jet after this anyway, so I think we're okay. I think we're okay. And the bounce is going to come down on the protected Conkeldur. Uh, then we're going to probably have the dark. Oh, the darkness comes out. We're faster than Conkeldur. I didn't expect that. That is going to do a chunk, and meaning it's going to knock it out. Uh, right now he's a flying type. So, I mean, I might as well mock and Aqua Jet, right? There's, I mean, because he can't KO both. Um, Cronaut's going to come out of its max. And then, <laughs> uh, yeah, you know what? I don't really, it's going to do, it's going to help. He can't KO us both, and we have priority again in the next turn. So there's no way two Drain Punches and two Choice Banded Aqua Jets does not KO. There's just no way. So Aqua Jet first. You see that? That does... Oh my... What? How does he... That is actually a problem. If he KOs Cronon... Oh no! Miss! <laughs> Are we going to lose to that? We might lose to that. Um, I, should, I, I can't believe that did so little. Oh, he still has his screen, doesn't he? He still has his screen, doesn't he? Yep, he did. Um, so I'm going to mock Punch again. Because he is now fight. Oh, yeah, we're fine. Because he's fighting type now. He's not going to resist it. And he doesn't have the other move. And we have Protect, so if he goes in a flying type. Yeah, we're... Yep. <laughs> Here I am thinking we lost the game. No, we're still fine. Although I got a little hairy when I wasn't really sure there. Uh, just making nonsense plays. Alright. I am really, really glad that I started finally doing this, though. Um, we'll do probably three episodes with each team, and then I'll open a new one. We'll see. Um, we'll see. All right, so there's we start out with the TCG to VGC, and we go three and oh, okay, not bad, not bad. Um, maybe I'll make it a thing too if I can like go like nine and zero with the team or something. I'll take it to master rank if I'm even at master rank at that point with my main uh, account. Uh, so we probably hit rank three here, right? Now this is obviously overcalling it because we had one DC and we had one person <laughs> using a the the cpu rental team but um all right oh my all the way to four look at that okay all right well that was fun and uh we'll uh, i'll catch you next time